The Tirana International Airport Nene Teresa Albanian, Aeroporti Intercombetor i Terrains Nene Teresa, IATA, TIA, ICAO, LATI, often referred to as the Rhinas International Airport, is the main international airport of the Republic of Albania. It serves the city of Tirana, its metropolitan area, and surrounding region in the county of Tirana. The airport is named in honor of the Albanian Roman Catholic nun and missionary, Mother Teresa. It is located 6 nautical miles, 11 kilometers, 6.9 miles northwest of Tirana in the municipality of Kruja, Duras County. It offers international connections primarily within Europe, whereas the most frequent routes are to Milan, Rome and Istanbul. The airport will serve as the main hub for the national flag carrier Air Albania as well as Albines. It also serves as a focus city for Adria Airways, Blue Panorama Airlines and Ernest Airlines. In terms of passenger volume, it is the largest airport in Albania and the 12th in Balkan Peninsula. History Early history The airport was constructed during a period of two years, from 1955 to 1957. However, Tirana had commercial airline services before. Domestic aviation starts in 1926 when German airline Adria Aero Lloyd obtained monopoly for all domestic air routes in the country and began servicing a Tirana and Skoder, Kors and Vlor. This operations proved unprofitable, and the airline sold its rights to Italian company Alla Littoria which opened regular routes in 1935 between Tirana to Škoder, Kuks, Peshkopia, Kuchova, Vlor, and Girokostra. In 1938, the Yugoslav carrier Aeroput introduced regular commercial flights linking Tirana with Belgrade, Serbia with a landing in Dubrovnik, Croatia, after the end of Second World War and installation of an isolationist communist regime in Albania, air transportation was rare. From 1944 and 1948 there was a service to Belgrade, but after the break of relations with Yugoslavia, until 1953, there was only a twice-a-month connection to Budapest operated by Soviet-Hungarian company Mazovlet. From 1953 and 1955 there was no air service, until February 1955 when a route to Moscow was inaugurated, followed thereafter to other Eastern European capitals. In the 1970s, Tirana was one of the first European cities to be served by China's CAAC Airlines, with a weekly flight to Beijing via Bucharest and Tehran. In the late 1980s there were six airlies flying to Tirana, with a total of nine round trips per week. With the collapse of communism in Albania in 1991 and subsequent liberalization of travel restrictions abroad for Albanians, the number of airlines operating at the airport increased rapidly. In 1999 there were 8.249 flights and 356.823 passengers, seven times more than in 1991. Topic: <laughs> Post-communism. The air traffic equipment and facilities of the airport have been heavily modernized, following investments by Tirana International Airport SHPK, a consortium led by Hoktif Airport. Hoktif assumed management of the airport on 23 April 2005, for a 20-year concession period. The concession included the construction of a completely new passenger terminal and various infrastructure improvements, among them the construction of a new access road, new parking lots, and a bridge over the old airport access road. The expansion resulted in an increased number of passengers per annum, estimated at 1.5 million passengers for 2009. The number of passengers effectively increased to more than 1.5 million in 2010. The terminal building and its second expansion, the cargo building, its landscaping and car park canopies was designed by Malaysian architect Hin Tan of Hinton. In December 2016, the airport announced that it has served 2 million passengers during 2016, reaching its second milestone. Topic: Ownership As of 2017, China Everbright Limited is the sole owner of Tirana International Airport Nene Teresa. 
After reaching an agreement with the Albanian government to end its monopoly on international flights from Albania, Hoktif Airport sold the operating of Tirana International Airport Nene Teresa to China Everbright Limited, a company specializing in asset management, direct investment, brokerage and investment banking. China Everbright Limited has the right to operate Tirana International Airport Nene Teresa until 2027. Airlines and destinations Statistics Traffic Busiest routes Topic Ground Transportation Topic Car The airport is linked with motorway SH sixty ten kilometres away to SH two Duras Tirana Access Road. Taxis and car rental facilities are available at the airport. Taxis are available at the airport. The journey from Tirana to the airport takes 20 to 25 minutes, depending on traffic. Many taxi companies offer a flat rate for to, from airport trips the rate is usually 1,500 all. Bus Rhinus Express Airport Bus, located outside Arrivals Terminal, leaves on the hour every hour 8 a.m. to 7 p.m., to the city center, and the trip takes around 25 to 30 minutes. Rhinus Express operates 12 hours 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. as an hourly bus service between the airport and the National Museum in the center of Tirana. The single fare is 250 Albanian lek. From Duras the rate for a single fare is 480 Albanian lek. Topic: Incidents and accidents. October 3, 2006, Turkish Airlines Flight 1476, flying from Tirana to Istanbul, was hijacked by Hakan Akinci in Greek airspace. The aircraft, with 107 passengers and six crew on board, transmitted two coded hijack signals which were picked up by the Greek Air Force. The flight was intercepted by military aircraft and landed safely at Brindisi, Italy. June 30, 2016, three armed and masked people entered the cargo terminal, where they stole a huge amount of money that was to be transported abroad on airplanes. The amount of cash could have been up to 3 million euros. The incident caused national security concerns. See also Transport in Albania Economy of Albania